Oh, hi guys. Welcome back to Game of Play Games. Hi, everybody. Last we left off, we got the Lord of the Land. Now we're going to talk to this sucker and seal the deal. Name Brahmin. What's his name? Brulin. Father Father. Father B. It'd be funny if it did break out into a battle. Yeah, right. Oh, truly, this power is the stuff of miracles. Hmm, it looks like he really can't sense us at all. I shall worship this sacred water with all my being. Oh, venerable Uno, I am yet inexperienced, but would that I could serve thee for all eternity. <laughs> but he is earnest. I'll at least give him that. What was that? I feel like a sort of wind just blew right through me. The blessing has returned to this town. This town is now under my domain. But in order to maintain the blessing, I will need cooperation from the people. Indeed, there are all kinds of methods besides prayer that one can use to uphold the blessing. Like? For example... I see. I'll be sure to give it a try. <sighs> this sure sounds like a pain to me. I will do what little I can. Hmm? What's wrong? I can still feel a powerful malevolence. And it's not far off. It's somewhere in town. That's the royal palace. So this is a conversation with the Seraphim? A bunch of lunatics talking to themselves out loud? You are? I am a messenger from Chancellor Bartlow of the Highland Government. I have come to invite Surrey to a private dinner conference in light of his great suffering for the sake of Lady Lake. Have you been watching over Surrey? Not at all. In fact, I was quite surprised. That the Princess of Highland, as distant as her claim to the throne may be, would have relations with the Shepherd that are so... intimate. I'm sure this news will please your beloved subjects to no end, your highness. If you are insinuating that... Alicia! Where to? Roundable Palace. Very well. Tell Bartlow I accept his proposal. Please, you mustn't get involved with the Chancellors. I can feel it from them. The malevolence does seem to be coming from them. I apologize for being so weak. I just can't wait for malevolence to actually be a power of, like, good. <laughs> no, right? Be more malevolent, guys. We were just so happy as monsters. Why did you have to go and kill everyone? Yeah, right? You... You ruined everything. <coughs> Okay, so Lord oh, of the crap. Land. So this is some cool stuff where um, we can now fast travel between save points that we've unlocked. Oh, cool! Which, this is why I've been bouncing into save points and not always saving. Is So now they're unlocked, now we can travel to them. I think, I'm oh, pretty sure cool. that's how it works. Um, I hope so. We can so. also set boons. So based <laughs> on our grade that we've accumulated for the region that the Lord is in control of, yeah. we can heal level up. And then he'll get boons. Or you like can get boon treasure points. restoration? So, yeah. So, like, leave treasures for some time after claiming them, and they'll be automatically refilled. Oh, sweet. Yeah, right? This is this is kind of what I was talking about with uh, new items, <laughs> right? In the last episode. That would be really funny if it was the same item over and over again. It's like, great, this is my... Great, great I have 17 feather. amber boots. Yeah, but, like, there's, there's <clears throat> other stuff, too. Like, obviously, the best is probably the drop, drop rate, rate boost. boost. Hell yeah. Um, and this is probably... Important for hard mode, probably. Dude, let's get that boon 
count up. It's. <coughs> I mean, it's not easy, right? Our grade right now oh is 25, God. and we need 100 in order for him to hit the next level. Um, we can offer items to him, which each have their own value. So if we gave him 11 oh. apple gels, we would get 17 grape, which that's probably the best way to kind of expedite this. Um, especially safe. because especially because there are a lot of items where, like, apple gels, oftentimes I'm just like, I have so many of these, so many that I can't even take any more out of treasure trusts. Mm. So that's kind of your way of getting rid well, of Well, especially since it seems like we're doing very well at this point, at this point of not needing oh, man. Mm. gels. I never considered this, but I generally sell my items that I'm what not using What if you anymore. gave them instead? Yeah, and I actually wonder if they are worth more if you rank up the stars for them. That's something we should look into. Oh, that would actually be kind of cool. Yeah. Wait, go back. Battle boots plus one. Oh, weird. Yeah, uh, well, hmm. Yeah, I don't know. No, what battle boots plus one are just a one star rank, though. It's just a one star rank. This one's two star rank. Oh, okay. yeah, got it. Yeah, one's two. So be, maybe there is there a you go. There's your proof. But right this there. one is is worth the most, and it has no stars. So yeah, maybe, I don't it's, get it. maybe it's based on the uh, the like bonuses or the mm. skills on them. Yeah, that's interesting. Um, so yeah, this I actually really really like that system. I think yeah, it's, it's kind of clever. And there's even more that comes with this later on too that uh, we'll see in probably like ten episodes or so. I also really like that um, the humans, whenever they're talking about the Seraph, obviously excluding the Chancellor's bitch, but um, yeah, right. the the human who is going to be the the, the Lord of the Land um, was very very proper and very very like religious in his his dialect and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. And the Seraph was like. Eh, he's cool. <laughs> that's fine. Yeah, guy's earnest enough. So yeah, it's just it's kind of funny watching the the two like polar opposite behaviors right. sort of get along with one another. It's it's fun too because it's because the humans can't see the seraphim that they feel like they have to be so proper, proper, proper. proper, respectful, and polite. Uh, the seraphim and are like, seraphim dude, are just chill, like, man. It's dude, cool, whatever, yeah. man. Like I don't care, dude, man, bro. Dude, whoa, man, bro. whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. I, I don't know if I talked about that. I think I talked about that in one of the episodes. You might have. That flickering, that's the character models freaking oh, out. You did talk about that, but that might have been on our original one that got <laughs> Oh, Oh, yeah, that's wiped. right. Or maybe not. I don't remember. I wonder if Lord Bartlow will be like a fighting enemy at some point or just like a plot enemy. Yeah. It's, I I don't totally know. Um, Some of these guys just end up, you know, throwing henchmen <coughs> at you. Where? So I'm supposed to follow him, but I can still kind of wander around. But you know, obviously. Because we're dicks. Because we're dicks. He's also really <coughs> slow. But we'd be like, oh man, I can't do anything here. Man, that's a shame. It's too bad they didn't have some knights blocking the staircase, so I didn't waste this time. Yeah. Right. I, I mean, I'm not really complaining, I guess, but. But you're, you're just kind of. But like. He's going so slow. Oh my god. At least I can explore a little bit. Yeah, be like, let's see where we can go later. Yeah, right? Like, like oh, that spot this. there might have something yeah. cool. And here we go. But I can't go in. Ooh, that, let's, see, let's see if he passes through you. Oh, maybe that's another room. Maybe it's... No, it is. It, he, you know, it is. Oh, he did stop what there. Okay. in the Shh. world? Please go and I have to get us away from him. Okay. Okay. Yes, sir. Oh, you, Kitty. you just told us that. Why are you in the room? You were just outside. That's probably another one. Uniforms, man. They're just everywhere. <laughs> okay, so this is kind of a fun point where we can just kind of chat with anyone. Um, we'll save, because we might as well. We probably just should. Level 10, I think this is us. Yeah. I hope so. Well, it's level 10. I mean, it wouldn't be Jen. No, that's true. Jen's farther than I am at this point. It wouldn't be you. No. What's that? So now you can just talk to whoever. I hope, I hope he says what's that to everybody. What's that? And what's that? Yeah. So that that's... I, I don't know if we've talked about it, but that's one of Saray's powers is that he can discover points of interest. Because um, he's the main character and... Yeah. You have to find I mean, they all main have... Main character plot power. They all have their own um, support talents. So, like... Everyone has snack preparation, and that's what Miklio has right now. He can detect treasure, but it's basically useless because 
if there's treasure nearby, you already see it. Yeah, right. It's not like, oh, there's hidden treasure under that rock there. Oh, now, okay. now, the radius does get larger as his proficiency increases, but I have yet to but really see... But then at the same time, that, that would almost make it like less useful. Because yeah, right. then it's like, oh, there's treasure nearby, and then you're in a hallway, and then you're like... No, Whoa. actually, well, I think when he detects it, it shows up on your map. Oh! Yes. Um, I see. But yeah. when you have to be five feet away, it suddenly doesn't matter anymore. Right. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Saray has point of interest, which that just gives you cutscenes and AP for free. Gotcha. Um, they all have snack preparation. Treasure detection is you know that, and then Alicia has remedy, and Lila has eight health, health maintenance. maintenance. So you steadily recover HP while moving. Oh, that's kind of nice. So this is super super useful because as we battle, if you notice, I haven't re- really been spending. Um, items to yeah, recover after battle. Really, which is good. It's purely because of that ability. Oh man, when she betrays us, that's gonna suck unless someone else gets the health restoration ability. Yup. Infinite books! Just what you'd expect from a royal palace. Quite a collection of rare and valuable tomes. Lots that deal with history and ancient relics too. Oh, I just want to sit and read them all. Oh my, this book has an interesting title. Mad Screams of Love. A poetry book maybe? Let's check it out. Yeah, careful! It's gonna look like the book's floating in midair! Don't worry, Alicia will hand wave it away for us somehow. Oh, for... Uh, here, gimme. I'll hold it. Wow, Mad is right. An ode to young passions. A lonely voice, screaming love and anguish to the heavens. You just know the author's gonna look back at this ten years later and cringe. Angsty doesn't even begin to cover it. So that's what's so mad about it. Really? It all sounds pretty good to me. Huh? Saray, I think that's because you're so... So inherently enthusiastic. You guys okay? You look kind of... Uh, mad. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, Saray, you're so uh, innocent. Yes. All right. Well... Well, let's, let's wrap up the conversations with all these guys. God damn. No, that's wow. Cool. I'm just kidding. Well... We better relax while we still can. Things smell like they're gonna get ugly. At least, they've got some nice books here. Hey, that's kinda cool that Miklo can smell danger. <laughs> he didn't have that on his skill tree. Oh, okay, ready? The Chancellor surrounded the young king to not care for much. They think my lost starting in the line of succession she gave me all the political affairs. Forgot me, I done made a post on you. You know, think about what this game would be like if they actually talked like this. Oh, is it my turn? Yep. Yep. People involved in politics <laughs> quickly become tainted. If only everyone could be as pure-hearted as Alicia. It's actually kind of sweet. Actually, it kind of is. When that bitch betrays us later, we'll be like, <laughs> man, what a tainty You taint. just activated plot, and it's the end of the episode. Ah, Damn it, fine. Chris. Although, if you notice, the, the knight did say, is that book floating yeah. in it? <laughs> And it's like some crazy juju when the shepherds are out. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I I kind of wish that they they used that more often. Yeah, right. Game. Like they're so afraid that humans are gonna freak out, but like they're never gonna get better if you don't make them get used to it. Yeah, right. And they're gonna keep thinking Saray is crazy if he's talking to himself. <laughs> it's about a yet unfinished job. Sorry, but I'm staying behind after all. This way. I shall guide you to the round table chamber. Well, I guess next time we can see how sad I get. No, we can't do next no, we time because do we're doing plot. Because someone just well, decided to trigger it. Not, not next time, this, this is also the last episode of this recording session, so. We might as well wrap up the plot stuff. Plot stuff! Yeah! Extra long episode! With Chris Cujo and Tony! Even though plot we've already stuff. had long episodes, oh my, this plot is going stuff. to be... Oh, yep. I can just get pushed by him. Yeah! <laughs> you should just do that and be like... <laughs> And look, he's like, look, 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 look he's like, yeah. he's like, posing cool. like, are you? What? Come on, come on, come on, you have time to do it, you have time to do it one more time. 
Oh, oh, oh no! Wait, did you get a cold sensation when you did that? Oh. <laughs> Alright, let me in. Man, that sucks because I was gonna do the Ryu theme again, and then I went... <gasps> oh. There we go. Plot armor with Chris Pucho and Tony! Plot stuff! Look at that table. Sorry to have kept you waiting, gentle shepherd. Please, take a seat. Poison pot pie. Don't worry. I promise you, it's not poisoned. We simply felt it would be best to be closer to you. Let me introduce you. This is Military Chancellor Mathia, leader of the Royal Army. This is Professor Simon, administrator of the law in Highland. And this is Archbishop Nathael, the highest ranking holy man in the kingdom. And last, the man who manifests the will of the king himself. Barnlow. I'm Saray. Thank you very much for your invitation. We have much to discuss. Whoa, Saray, I hope you don't trust them. He does indeed have spunk. That, or perhaps he's just that much of a simpleton. It's quite delicious, though I would have liked to let Alicia taste it as well. What is your relation with Lady Alicia, if I may ask? We're just friends. She invited me to come to the outside world with her. How about we drop this silly game and have you tell us the real story, hmm? Hmm? They're suggesting that you and Alicia are using each other. Hatching some sort of nefarious plot together. I'm not using Alicia. The Shepherd does not do such things. Oh, he doesn't. I couldn't say. I've never actually seen a Shepherd before. So they doubt you. I figured as much. Believe me or don't, I don't care. Well, we do care. It would be quite the scandal if the royal family had produced a false shepherd to curry favor with the populace. Careful. And so you're asking for proof that I'm the real shepherd? <laughs> Truth be told, it matters not whether you're real or just a boy in a silly outfit. The issue is that regardless, the citizens are beginning to side with you. It's the nature of the people to yearn for some dramatic sort of salvation. An easy way to have their every desire fulfilled. True. The Shepherd in every era has always suffered greatly from the people's grandiose expectations. The common man is but a fool and a cur. It's an unfortunate observation, but that is the reality of it. But in fact, it is for that very reason that we need you. Me? Why me? I will be perfectly frank with you. We are asking you to work under us, Shepherd Saray. As the Shepherd who would protect Highland, we want you to reinvigorate the people, boost their morale. The rampant disasters have rather dampened the people's spirits lately. It's very unfortunate for the Council. Those ignorant fools, right when we're on the brink of war with Rollins. We will reward you handsomely, of course. This is your advance. If you're really all the rumors say, I hear that you're quite interested in ancient ruins, yes? Were you to side with us, surely this would be sufficient to facilitate your explorations and archival activities, would it not? <laughs> There's no point in siding with Princess Alicia. The princess is to be transferred to the city of Marland, where the epidemic yet thrives. They're sending her to a plague town? Surely even our spirited Princess Knight will learn her limits after toiling in such a star-crossed locale. Of course, if she herself were stricken with illness, I suppose she would have bigger things to worry about. <laughs> So then, Shepherd Saray, there's nothing to even think about, is there? I refuse. Darn. Guess they weren't the type you can sit down and talk with after all. Probably better this way. 
proud words from a false shepherd. You and Alicia will both learn the hard way what comes from crossing us. Wait! What on earth is going on here? What are armed guards doing in the palace? These are Lord Bartlow's orders. <laughs> Lord Bartlow, what is the meaning of this? Stand down at once. Nice castle, but we're done here. Let's go, Alicia. I can fulfill my dreams without your help. And the same goes for Alicia. Indeed it does. Death to the name Shepard, who deceives the people! Stand back! The name Shepard! Whoops. Alright, looks like we're gonna be having a really long episode. I don't think it'll be too bad. I think we can save after... We beat these guys down, and another cutscene happens. And then another cutscene, and then an anime scene. Then after that, guys. Yeah, yeah. We're like all good. And you know, honestly, it's probably kind of nice to get through a decent chunk of plot in a single episode. Right, because that way it's not like two episodes that are covered just by one scene. Right, right. And I mean, honestly, I feel like it. it this game would fit the 15-minute episodes format pretty well, but it's just, it's hard to put out a lot of content if we break it down by 15 minutes, so. <coughs> but maybe if, if uh, people are really enjoying the series, yeah, we, we, can, can, we can start looking into making these 15 minutes. Yeah. Lord Bartlow, we will forgive this transgression. In exchange, you will never threaten the Shepherd again. Am I being clear? Impossible. You will plunge the kingdom into upheaval. And if by any chance, he were to fall into Roland's hands. <laughs> I'd be more worried about your own neck if I were you. Who are you? Scattered bones. Assassins! Yes, that man approached us and tried to hire our guild to murder your princess here. <gasps> Are you saying Lord Bartlow was plotting to kill Alicia? D don't be ridiculous! He says we're liars. Should we kill him? <laughs> Enough! I beg of you, please stop. The Kingdom of Highland needs this man. <laughs> You're all you're made out to be. Listen and listen well, Bartlow. We do not kill against our own honor. Understood. <laughs> Why? He's fine. They didn't kill him. So now we know who ordered the assassination of Alicia. <laughs> and also now we know why they didn't kill Alicia. <laughs> because they didn't agree with usual it. Assassins, mm -hmm. That's really cool. I'm impressed they snuck into the palace. Apprehend them! They're the conspirators! Not good. Thanks to you, our work was quick and painless. Here's your reward. Follow us. Bam, okay. Alright, the plot has definitely thickened in this episode, <laughs> and, and I think kids. it's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah no, that I, was a really Now I'm actually, scene. like, hooked. This, I think this is kind of one of those those big, like, it's a good turning, turning, point. turning points it's for the plot. very good turning point. And points. shit's gonna start really, really getting crazy from here. Awesome. So, stay tuned for more, right. and, uh... Thanks for sticking through this super long <laughs> episode, guys. Yeah, man, hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you guys in the archives. Oh, I wish I was an Oscar Mayer wiener. What did you actually do? I don't, I don't think, I'm calling you on your bluff. Fuck. Uh, you would be both not alive and consumed, probably. I'm sure it's part of all of us in an Oscar Mayer wiener. Yes. Deep thoughts with Tony. <laughs>